What a lovely world. So I know this may not be the most interesting com this interesting topic for every single person on this planet, but for me, that's this is my fit. This is something I wanted to discuss with you guys, and it's very important to me. Now. I know everyone has their own favorite day of the week, whether it's starting the work week on Monday or, or, or some, someone might like Tuesday or Wednesday or Thursday. But for me, the, there's, there's three ways to look at it. If you're, if you're a, if you're a, um, a hockey player or hockey player, if you're a football fan, a professional NFL football fan from the United States, you will know that Sunday is the most important day of the week because that's when the games take place every single Sunday. Unless it's the playoffs, there might be one game on Saturday that you look forward to or, you know, there's a couple games that could be on Monday night or, you know, or on Thursday night. But mostly, for the most part, every single week there's a football game on Sunday. At least one that you can look forward to from your team, the team that you've been following for years or if you're following a team for the first time because you don't watch sports. Now, the second most important day of the week, for me at least, is Saturday. Now, if you're a college football fan, you'll know what I'm talking about because College football usually goes every single Saturday. There might be games scattered around throughout the week, like on Thursday or on Friday or Saturday, but most of the most of the time, a football game starts on Saturday. Uh, every single week until you know, until like what is it, January, the middle of January from. From like August to January, so it's about like a good four or five months. Same with the NFL; it starts in September and goes till February. So I mean, and and then my my real 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 favorite day of the week is Friday, and I'm going to tell you why. Because Friday starts the weekend, and speaking of which, today this video is filmed on a Friday. <laughs> Which is my favorite day of the week. My favorite. Think about that. It's my favorite day of the week. Now I'm not the guy that I'm not that guy that used to go out every single Friday or Saturday night like I used to in my twenties. Even though technically my twenties were still two years ago, as of April this year. But the fact of the matter is, is that you know I still love Friday. Friday is, you know, it starts the weekend, it kicks the weekend off, you know, you get to do amazing things on the weekend, some some things may be better than others, like, for example, when I was, you know, going to a bar, whether it, was, whether it be, you know, the two bars that I used to frequent a lot in my 20s, I used to go almost every single weekend, when from 21 to 29. Except for 25 through 27. I didn't really go every single weekend. And when I reached 28, 29, I didn't really go every single weekend. So basically what I'm trying to say is from 21 to 24, I used to go pretty frequently to, to a bar. And I'm not saying I'm going to do that again in, 20, in, in my 30s. But I do want to go to at least... A bar for this birthday, which I know you guys are sick and tired of me talking. My birthday this year is on a Friday. See, that's why Friday is such an amazing day because it starts the weekend. It could mean you celebrate your birthday on that day if you're going to a bar or if you're going to a club. Friday and Saturday nights are the popping nights to go to a club. Whether it's a nightclub, whether it's a strip club, or whether it's a dance club, whatever it is, Friday and Saturday nights are probably the most popular nights to go to some sort of a club. And bar is the same thing. Friday and Saturday nights are the best nights to go to a bar or a pub or whatever you call it in your country or whatever, you're, whatever you call it, basically. 
And that's what Friday night used to be for me in my early 20s to right around my mid-20s. And then I did go a couple times here and there between my 27th and 29th, but not as much as I did between my 21st and my 20, 24th. I used to go a lot between those ages. I don't plan on doing that in my 30s or in my 40s. I want to go. I want to go this year because I haven't been to this specific bar in a very long time, and I would like to go back there and see what's what's happened since I've last been there. And like, I'm not saying I would go every single weekend. Maybe one weekend every year. Like, make you like a tradi- like a a tradition. Just one day every single year, except for my 35th, because we're planning something big for that. And and for my 40th, even though technically that's, you know, that's another uh, decade of my life that's, you know, a couple years down the road. Anyways, actually it's nine years down the road. Anyways, I just wanted to share with you guys what, what days of the week are my favorite days of the week. Now, I know a lot of people, or a lot of human beings don't like to think of Friday, Saturday, and Sunday as great days of the week. Because some some think Monday through Thursday are great days of the week. And there are still others that believe Friday through Sunday are great days of the week. I mean, if you love football or if you love college football or if you like going out to a bar or a club, you know the weekends are most most happen in times of the week on on, on Friday through Sunday. Saturday, Friday and Saturday. Sunday it's kind of it kind of kind of dies down, and then you have to start the week up again. But I just thought I would let you guys know. It it may sound a little weird. It may sound you know like I'm just rambling on about the weekend and stuff. But that's my favorite time of the week. The week is Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Friday being the most important one, and then Saturday and Sunday, you know, kind of come in a close second. And then the rest of the week is kind of like drags on a little bit too long. But that's just my opinion. You don't have to listen to my opinion. I'm just saying Friday and Saturday and Sundays are my favorite days of the week. Monday through Thursday are not as exciting for me. I mean, sure, I like to go see movies, and but you guys all know that during the week. On the weekend, you got to, you know, party a little bit and stuff like that. I don't do that you know, a whole bar hopping and club crawling or whatever they call it these days because I'm getting old. I mean, I'm going to be 31 in like two weeks and 10 days. Two and a half, two weeks and about a, two months and a week and a half. And I'm ready for my 31st. I wanted to be here as quickly as possible, but that's just, that's just me. You don't have to celebrate your birthday like I do. You can celebrate your birthday however which way you want to celebrate it. You can stay in and have a few drinks or you can go out with some friends, like go to lunch or dinner or you can, you know, you go do what I'm planning on doing for my 31st by going to a bar or you can go to dinner with some friends and and or you can do go to dinner with family. It's just, that's just it. That's all I've got to say on this whole subject, so... Um, let me know in the comment section down below, what's your favorite day of the week? Is it Monday? Is it Tuesday? Is it Wednesday? Is it Thursday? Is it Friday? Is it Saturday? Or is it Sunday? That's seven days. So you guys let me know what you guys, what day of the week is your favorite day of the week? Because I'm curious. And usually movies in theaters come out on, or are released on a Friday And then on DVD, they're usually released on a Tuesday, mostly. So, uh, I I hope you guys have a a great 2020 so far. And I hope that the rest of 2020 is just as amazing as the first two months and a week. And we'll see what happens. And I hope you have an amazing birthday. And not just amazing, an awesome, fun creative birthday, whatever you're celebrating, whatever age you're celebrating this year, whether you're male or you're a man or a woman, 
whatever age. You guys know the drill. Keep real. And I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.